I'm Tristan. I'm going to show you how to make a shadow puppet. And this is my stuffed animal banana monkey. And this is my sister Lanta. And this is her stuffed animal bear. And my next video will be, will be showing you how to make a shadow puppet. First, we chose a story. Then, we did some sketches of our ideas. We chose a big cardboard box and painted our background and Mommy cut it out. I drew the puppet Mommy cut it out again. We used chopsticks and Play-Doh to put on, but it didn't work. So then we used sticks and tape. And then you put it, tape it on your puppet and then you're done! Once upon a time, a long time ago, in a sunny, warm place where there never was snow, there was a forest of trees so beautiful and fair, orange, red, yellow, pink, and soft like fox hair. One day the wanderer came walking about, and when he saw the trees, he let out a shout. Oh, these trees, these trees, these truffler trees, all of my life I've been Searching for trees such as these. The touch of their tufts is much softer than silk, and they have the sweet smell of fresh butterfly milk. So the wanderer got busy and set up a shop. Then he chopped down the truffler tree with one chop. The instant he finished, he heard a good lump, and suddenly something popped out of the stump. He was shortish and oldish and brownish and mossy, and he spoke with a voice that was sharpish and bossy. Mister, he said with a sawdust sneeze, I am the Lorax and I speak for the trees. He was very upset as he shouted and puffed, What's that thing you made out of my travel account? Look, Lorax, said Wunzler, there's no cause for alarm. I chopped just one tree. I'm doing no harm. I'm being quite useful. This thing is a need. A need to find something that all people need. The Lorax said, There you are crazy with greed. There is no one on earth who would buy that fool need. But the Lorax was wrong. And a trap came along who said that need is great. And paid $3.98. The wanderer built a great chopping axe and started chopping with loudly loud wax. And the Lorax saw this and got more and more mad. He wanted to break the machine really bad. The Lorax hopped on the machine. He was hopping and hopping, but the wanderer ignored him and kept chopping and chopping. <laughs> 